good day class. You are welcome to Lagos State e-learning program. I am Afolabi Ademola Ladapo. I teach mathematics. The topic we want to treat today is graphical solution of inequalities. Lesson objectives. By the end of the lesson, students will be able to, one, solve graphically inequalities in one variable using number line. Two, solve graphically inequalities in two variables using the Cartesian plane. Three, interpret inequality graphs in one and in two variables. Four, minimize or maximize a given function using the solution region. On today's topic, we are going to solve some inequality problems involving graphs. We first of all look at the number lines in the following ranges of values of x. This shows that the number lines are in one variable. Example, what range of values of x makes each of the following on the number lines? Roman figure one, minus two less than x and x less than five. Solution. Combining the inequalities, we have minus two less than x less than five. Now the number line drawn for the values of x. We discover that the range of values starts from minus two to five. But the points minus two and five are not included as part of the solution. Hence, the open rings on the solution line above the number line. Roman figure two, minus one less than x less than four. Solution, minus one less than x less than or equal to four. Solution, now the number line drawn. On the number line, we will discover that the range of values of x is between minus 1 and 4, where the point minus 1 is not part of the solution set, but point 4 is included. Hence, the open ring on minus 1 and the closed ring on 4. The third one, Roman figure 3, x less than minus 3 and x greater than 2. The graph, the number line graph is drawn. It is discovered here that <clears throat> the arrow of values on minus 3 goes to the left, while the arrow of the arrow of values of x on 2 goes to the right. This makes the range of values not combinable. Now let's look at some inequalities on the Cartesian plane. For example, on the Cartesian plane, show the region represented by each of the following inequalities. A, x is greater than 4, B, y less than or equal to minus 2, C, y is greater than or equal to 0, D, x greater than or equal to 0. Solution. Graph for x greater than 4, drawn as that. For x greater than 4, we locate the point 4 and draw a broken line through 4 parallel to the y-axis and shade the portion to the right. 
it is a broken line because the point 4 is not included in the range of values of x. Graph for b, that is y less than or equal to minus 2. The graph drawn as above. For y less than or equal to minus 2. We locate the point minus 2. And we draw a continuous line through minus 2 parallel to x axis and shade the portion downwards. It is a continuous line because the point minus 2 is included in the range of values of x. Likewise, for y greater than or equal to 0 and x greater than 0, x greater than or equal to 0, we have the following graphs respectively. With the above, we will, in the next segment, solve inequalities in two variables simultaneously in graphical form. Make sure to time out. Welcome back, class. Now, in this segment, we are going to look at graphical solution of inequalities in two variables. Example, show graphically the region which satisfies the following simultaneous inequalities. 3x plus 2y less than or equal to 6. Let's call that Roman figure 1. X minus 2y greater than or equal to minus 4. Roman figure 2. X greater than or equal to 0. Roman figure 3. Y greater than or equal to 0. Roman figure 4. The following are some steps we need to take to solve the above problems graphically. A. Get x and y intercepts by changing the inequality into an equation and state the coordinates of points. B. Make y the subject of inequality to get the direction and the behavior of the graph. C. Draw the graph. D. Locate the desired region by making R by making R the region that we need. Now we solve the inequalities one by one. For Roman figure one, three x plus two y. Is less than or equal to 6. For the intercepts, 3x plus 2y is equal to 6. Now, x intercept. When y is equal to 0, x is equal to 2. That is, the coordinate is 2, 0 in bracket. y intercept. When x is equal to 0, y is equal to 3, that is 0, 3, in brackets. Therefore, coordinates of points for the inequalities are 2, 0, and 0, 3. Let's call it capital A. 2, 0, and 0, 3, capital A. Then make y subject of the inequality we have y less than or equal to 6 minus 3x all over 2 for roman figure 2 x minus 2y greater than or equal to minus 4 the intercepts like we did for roman figure 1 x intercept is 
minus 4, 0 in brackets. And y intercept is 0, 2 in brackets. So coordinates of points are minus 4, 0, and 0, 2. Let's call that capital B. Making y subject of the inequality, we have y less than or equal to 4 plus x, or divided by 2. For Roman figure 3 and Roman figure 4, we use x equal to 0 and y equals to 0 and their inequality behaviors. Meet you after, after the timeout for the graph. Welcome back, class. The following is the graph of the inequalities solved in the last segment of this lesson. We take note of the following. A, in the graph, all the inequalities have equal to. Hence, the lines of the inequalities are continuous lines. B, we shaded the unwanted region. We shaded the unwanted region so that we wouldn't have a clumsy diagram, especially to locate and read the desired region R. C. The desired region has four corner points, which distinguish the solution region for further studies on the graph, especially minimization and maximization problems. Example, maximize z is equal to 3x plus 2y. We take the corner points in coordinate form. A, 0, 0. Therefore, z is equal to 3 into 0 plus 2 into 0. That gives us 0. B, 2, 0 is the coordinate. Therefore, z is equal to 3 into 2 plus 2 into 0, which gives us 6. C is 1 and 2.5. Therefore, z is equal to 3, 1 plus 2 into 2.25 which gives us 7.5. D, 0, 2 is the coordinate. Therefore, Z is 3 into 0 plus 2 into 2, which gives us 4. The maximum value is at point B, which is 7.5. While the minimum value of Z is at point A, which is 0. Here we draw the curtain we we'll make next time. Bye.